chicken wings and beer are two cornerstones of the American tailgate experience. But these wings were actually inspired by a brewery in Calgary, Canada. The wings are marinated in beer, seasoned with a spice rub, and smoke roasted on the grill. Chicken wings are perfect for tailgating, possessing a crackling crisp skin, moist meat, in a package small enough to eat with your fingers. These are marinated in beer, rubbed with spices, and slathered with sweet chili sauce. Bet you can't eat just one. And like all good tailgate parties, this one begins with beer. Open a bottle of your favorite beer and pour it over a dozen chicken wings. Marinate the chicken wings for at least four hours or as long as overnight. The way I got interested in barbecue, it's very interesting. Uh, barbecue found me. I didn't find barbecue. I was actually writing a series of books on low-fat food, and I had this... Uh, and it was almost like hearing a voice from God. And the voice said, follow the fire. And the idea was that I was to travel around the world studying how people grilled and barbecued in different countries, traveling what I came to call the world's barbecue trail. Next, the rub. Combine equal parts salt, black pepper, paprika, chili powder, then add celery seed for sweetness. Mix the ingredients for the rub with your fingers, breaking up any lumps in the paprika. Fast forward 12 hours. Drain the beer off the chicken wings. You see we always work on ice. And transfer the wings to another mixing bowl. Add the rub. and a tablespoon of oil and toss to coat the wings on all sides. And now the grill. I've lit half a chimney of charcoal. I'm gonna pour half the coals on one side of the coal pan and half the coals on the other. In other words, I'm going to set the grill for indirect grilling. Now place a handful of soaked hickory chips on each mound of charcoal and insert the grates and you're ready for business. Arrange the chicken pieces in the center of the grill, away from the direct heat, meaty side up. That way, as they indirect grill, the melting fat will base the meat. It is certainly smoky over here. Then close the grill and open the vents wide and smoke the chicken wings for about a half an hour. Halfway through the grilling process, baste the wings with melted butter. You afraid of grilling? You shouldn't be. It's the world's oldest cooking method. As a species, we probably wouldn't even be here if we hadn't discovered how to grill. Remember, grilling isn't brain surgery, folks. It's just common sense. There are really only two secrets to grilling, learning how to control the fire and learning to recognize when the food is done. Finally, remember, grilling is performance art. Stand in front of your grill confidently and comfortably and let the flames begin. So how do you tell when the wings are done? Well, make a tiny slit in the thickest part of one of the drumettes and check to see that there's no redness at the bone. These wings are ready. And they're as smoky and as crusty as you could wish for. And just before serving, 
tablespoon sweet Thai chili sauce over the wings. Then sprinkle with finely chopped peanuts or pistachios. Whether you're headed out to a day game or a night game, now you have the tactics to tackle the tailgate. Mm. See you next time.